With the release of the New England Mountains, it gave us a new potential to be able to take down another great one. That great one is going to be the Black Bear. The only thing about the Black Bear is we're going to have to hunt them at night. Well, we just got eyes on our first Black Bear out there. She's about 315 out, just barely on the back side of that hill. And it just so happens we're reserved them for 300, so... Got her! Whew! That was a close one. Okay, so here's kind of the setup that we have right here. We're along the edge of the river by the Wabanaki Valley, and I have three or four tree stands set up along here. And along the way, we're going to have bear all the way through here. And as we're going through, we're going to be able to get up from stand to stand to stand and be able to observe all the bear on this river system. Ooh, we got eyes on another black bear out there at about 250 as well. It's a level four male. I'm kind of out of breath, but I'm hoping we're not going to get a ton of drop. And we definitely didn't. He's going to go down right there as well. All right, so our sow black bear should be piled up around here somewhere. Because I'm pretty sure she cut back this way. Yeah, here's the sow down right here. Ended up getting a nice right lung shot at 347 yards. Yeah, so I did a ton of scouting on these rivers before I started this hunt. Just so you guys know, we spent, well, I spent a ton of time looking for black bear on pretty much the entire river system. But that was a double lung liver shot at 230. So there's no more bear all the way down there. And by scouting, let me show you what I'm talking about. I literally hunted from here all the way up to this point. Then I hunted from here, went up here all the way down to here. All right, guys. So we got another black bear out here. It's another sow. She's 300 yards out from us. But I happen to have a tree stand set up, I think, like right here. So we're going to go over there, potentially get in that stand. Um, if not, what I might do is just go for a shot from here, actually. Oh, can I take the shot from here? So yeah, we'll probably just take the shot from right here. About 300 yards, 296. We'll probably just hold a little bit above the heart. And hope that it sinks in there pretty good. Yep, definitely did. And that'll take her down. But the next spot, the tree stand should definitely come in handy. All right, let's get up in the stand here and have a look. Our saw is not too far away. In fact, she's piled up right there. Is that her? Well, she's over there somewhere. But anyways, we got another bear right there. It's going to be about a 370 yard shot on a boar black bear so let's see if we can't zero in for 300 all right there we go and let's get on him 370 we are in fact gonna have a little bit of drop but if we hold for center lung then we should be able to drop right into the heart and absolutely smoke that bear all right he's down there as well so there we go we took our first black bear down out of the tree stand with the 300 magnum um, I feel like this will work good once you find a couple of good spots where the bear are consistently at. Right now, I just don't have uh, that good of spots. I mean, I know where they're hanging out, but I also... Whoa. <laughs> Didn't try and do that. So, unfortunately, my zoom in button is the same exact button as the global chat. And I cannot get a different button. Like, I... I always use this. There's no way I'm going to use a different button. I've been using T for the last three years, four years. There's no way I'm going to use something different. So right now we just have to keep dealing with this problem until I can figure out a way for it to actually work. All right. So there was our shot 296 shoulder blade right behind the lung there and got a nice hit. Okay. So this is basically what I'm talking about. If you go into key bindings here, and you scroll down, you see where it says use skill? That is T. That is what it should be. But then if you scroll down, all the way down into the next section here, you're gonna see global chat message. And I should be able to change this to like, O oh, or something like that. But. Did it work? Hold on. Oh my god, I can't believe it worked. 
I've tried that so many times and it just wouldn't work. I am so glad we are able to change that. But there's our shot there. 371 yard shot on an 18 dusky male black bear. Nice left lung shot again, right on that front shoulder. Honestly though, I feel like we probably should have had double lung. Maybe the fact that we're 370 might have slowed it down just a tad bit, but we didn't hit shoulder. So I don't really see like why that would have slowed down like that. But anyways, we got him. Oh, just kicked one up right there. I never got a chance to even spot it. Oh yeah, there are definitely tracks. What was it? Ooh, decent bear as well. I got tracks here too from a red fox. Decent male. Yeah, that's a good one. Probably a six or maybe small seven. I wonder if we'll be able to track him down. All right, it looks like I cut across this river here somewhere. So that means one of these times we should get a decent look at him just now. He literally just cut across right in front of us. Not only that, there should be two bear here running side by side as well. There he is right there. 370 yards. And now that we know where to aim. 370 is a good ways out there. We don't exactly want to rush the shot. Smoked. That worked out pretty good. That actually might not even be the same bear that we're tracking, guys, because look. That's a different bear. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> I mean, well, it worked out because it led us to... Pretty nice bear. Nice level six. But it's not the one that we're tracking because we still have tracks right here. Oh, wrong button. All right, so our six should be down over here somewhere. We took him at about 380. Got some good blood right there. And I thought he ran back this way. But. Oh, he ran right here. I found him. All right, let's take a look. Should be our biggest bear so far. It is. It's actually going to be a gold. 19.31, a black. Got a double lung shot at 370. See, I was telling you guys, we should be able to get double lung at 370. But this thing was perfectly broadside. And I think that's what it has to do with. If it's slightly quartered away, probably not going to get double lung. Quartering at you a tad bit, probably not going to get double lung. But that shot there was absolutely perfect. And got our first gold. Black bear down. Well, at this point, I feel like if it's going to be at least a gold, then it should be worth it. We got him all the way down here by this little lake. Where is he at? Come on. Keep an eye out. Keep an eye out. Tracks there. Tracks there. Going up here. I am not seeing this bear. Now he's cutting this way. Where in the heck is this bear going? Unbelievable, there it is. It's a five medium. A five medium. Really? Well, I think we hit a pretty good shot on him. So I guess that's good. <laughs> pretty good shot. Talk about a running perfect shot with a 300 magnum and the red dot there he lays right there and that ends our wild goose chase <laughs> we tracked this thing for 2.5 miles 2.5 miles and I ended up ending it with a running double lung heart shot and the red dot sight what an epic shot <laughs> That bear was absolutely smoked. I am so glad we got him. <laughs> Just unfortunately, he wasn't near as big as I was hoping him he was going to be. Holy, that's a giant track. We just picked up a max weight black bear track and he's not too far away. I can't even believe the size of this track here. 
Especially considering the fact that the biggest bear that we've seen up to this point is only a level six. And he weighed like 350 pounds. This thing is going to be way bigger than that. Oh, it looks like he was actually resting around here. Interesting. So he rests here. But where does he go after that? I don't know. There's whitetail tracks here too. Well. He rests here from 1600 until 2000 at night. And then he probably drinks somewhere else. Now, there's a chance we could come back here during the day. No, there's not. Because look at how thick it is here. Like, in order to come and be able to sneak up on this bear, you would have to come from all the way across the river and somehow try and sneak across the river to get this thing. So, that is not an option. Got a bear way out there. That is not the bear that we're looking for. It's in fact a sow, but holy, that is definitely the bear that we're looking for. Big old level seven black bear cutting across right there, about 150 yards out from us. Now we could go for the shot, but I'd really like to find out where he's drinking at. Oh my God. Look at what's coming across the river right in front of us here, guys. That's our big black bear. He's coming across about 100 yards out from us. Any minute now, he's going to be somewhere around 80. Now, as much as I'd like to figure out where he's going to drink at... No way. He's going to stop right there. Oh my god, he's going to drink right there. 100 yards out from us. Okay, so this bear is actually drink walking. That's what I would call it. Because look at him. He's supposedly drinking. Oh, there we go. He stopped right there at 100 yards out from us. Man, I really want to take that shot, but... Oh, I just don't know if we should. Oh, we got it now. We don't have a choice now. He was about to bust us. And we smoked him right there. So we also have this bear over here. Which should have been a good hit unless she was further than I thought. Yeah, she was. She's all of 300 plus out there, so. But there's our big bear down right there. Let's go over here and go take a look at our biggest bear so far. Boy, they are not easy to find. We've covered a lot of ground and we've only seen one really nice black bear. And it just so happens to be the one that we just got right over here. All right, big old level seven max weight gold potential black bear is down right here. It's gonna be a black 21.28. Ended up getting a double lung liver shot at 109 yards out. So there we have it. Our biggest black bear of today's hunt. But that's going to be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you next time.